Daft Punk, one of the most influential seminal music duos of all time, have split up. The French pair, Guy Manuel de Homem Christo and Thomas Bangalter from Paris, founded Daft Punk in 1993. Throughout their career, they produced some of the most recognizable pop songs ever recorded, such as Around the World, One More Time and Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger. The musicians recently uploaded an 8-minute video on their YouTube account simply titled Epilogue, which appears to serve as a goodbye to the fans. Epilogue also appears to be an excerpt from Daft Punk's 2006 film A Trauma. It's not entirely clear why they split up at the time of writing. The news was confirmed by Pitchfork, which contacted the duo's longtime publicist, Catherine Fraser, to check, who said yes but didn't give any reason. The duo last performed at the 2017 Grammys alongside The Weeknd. Before then, they'd only performed three times since the last leg of their Alive tour in 2007. In their 28 years together, Daft Punk produced four studio albums, Homework, Discovery, Human After All, and Random Assess Memories. They also recorded the soundtrack for 2010's Tron Legacy and worked with The Weeknd on Starboy and I Feel It Coming. Daft Punk won six Grammys in their time, with the most recent award coming in 2014 for Random Assess Memories and Get Lucky, sweeping record of the year. They do have never been big talkers with the press, with Bangladesh saying they don't believe in the star system, we want the focus to be on the music. If we have to create an image, it must be an artificial image. That combination hides our physicality and also shows our view of the star system. It is not a compromise. We are trying to separate the private side and the public side. In an earlier interview, he said, people understand that you don't need to be on the covers of magazines with your face to make good music. Painters or other artists, you don't know them, but you know what they're doing. We are happy that the concept in itself is becoming famous. Bangalter continued, in France, you speak of Daft Punk and I'm sure millions of people have heard it, but less than a thousand people know our face. Which is the thing we're into. We control it, but it's not our physically, our persons. We don't want to run into people who are the same age as us, shaking our hands because we think we're exactly like them.